Hey guys, so I posted this picture a couple of days on Snapchat and my DM went crazy. So of course I filmed a tutorial to this look, so let's jump right into it. So the first thing she has done is um, part my hair out to the side because I am going to be having a swoop with this look. And she left a little bit of leave out out so that it can cover um, the tracks. And the only thing she did was sleek my hair down with gel. And she's using some black hairspray to get a more sharp defined part as well as cover some of my thinning areas around my edge. So once my natural hair is in a ponytail and braided at the ends, um, she is going to use some regular braiding hair, which was like 99 cents from my local beauty supply store. And she's just gonna braid that all the way down and she did only use one pack. So next, she is going to start working on the front of this style, which is like a swoop bang. Um, and she did use some hair paper, I guess that's what it's called. And basically what that is, is just a barrier or um, a piece of paper that protects your hair and your glue from, I guess, attaching to one another. And it also helps with removing um, the tracks from your head as well. Sorry guys. <laughs> so um, next only thing she is doing is getting ready to uh, swoop the hair back. She hates using gel on swoops. She just feels like it makes the swoops really hard and it just doesn't look natural. So she decided to use some hair mousse instead and just swoop the hair in behind the ear and using a bobby pin to secure it down as you can see in the back. So now that the swoop is perfect, we're gonna go ahead and move on to the back of my head. Um, so we're still using that hair paper and just wrapping it around the braid. Um, the hair paper is very important because it's also going to give a base for when it comes to wrapping the ponytail around the braid. And as you can see, she's just going all the way up until she gets to the top of my ponytail and just using a little bit of hair glue around that small little piece just to make sure it's secured. So the next thing is wrapping this long hair around this long braid. So the hair that I'm using today is from Wiggins Hair. This is their Brazilian Loose Wave. Um, I have in uh, 22, 24, and 26 and a 20 inch. And right now she is actually starting with the 24 inch bundle. It did take two bundles to achieve this look. Now with this hair, we didn't have to do any type of wand curl or anything like that because the curl of this hair is like a deep wand curl look. So that saved a lot of time when it came to styling the hair. Girl, this is a lot of hair, but you see how curly the hair is? This hair is perfect for the look that I was going for. Um, so the only thing she's doing now is kind of thinning out the hair a little bit, giving it more shape so that it doesn't just fall down. And this is what it's looking like so far. This is a lot of freaking hair. And of course I gotta get on Snapchat. So um, she did press out my leave out and used that to cover up those tracks that created the swoop. So this is pretty much the simple ponytail look that you guys wanted me to do a video on. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys get a chance to 
uh, recreate this look if you love it. Thanks so much for watching. All purchasing information on this hair that I used in this video will of course be below in the info bar. Bye guys.